My name's Justine and I run the visitor centre here at Sanctuary Mountain Mangatauteri. I've always been a quite an outdoorsy person. I think that that sort of developed into a real passion for nature. It's something I've enjoyed since I was a kid. Like I grew up reading my grandfather's nature fact files. Because there are so many of these amazing places that really look after wildlife, we have an amazingly diverse range of birds here and it makes us really special. I think it's a perfect way to sort of make the most of, of what the Waikato has to offer. Having all these wildlife enclosures around the region uh, is enabling those species to actually spread out around the region as well and therefore yeah, they're becoming more accessible, they're becoming more viewable to people. Uh, so Sanctuary Mountain Mangatau today is really special. Being in here in the bush and getting to see and hear a lot of the native birds that people wouldn't otherwise have an opportunity to see go to Otorohonga Kiwi House and actually get to see Kiwi up close and personal which is really quite special. They're really hard to see obviously being nocturnal and, and quite rare as well so that presents a really unique opportunity for people to, to go and get up close and personal with the Kiwi. Uh, feeding uh, kakariki and also seeing kiriru, they're quite cute, just a cute factor. Yeah. Wetlands uh, in, in the Waikato, the, the ones that we have left are really important for people to go and experience. It's quite cool that we have these little remnants for people to go to and, and really experience it. Uh, of course you could also go to Hamilton Zoo and do their face-to-face -face encounters, like um, get up close and personal with a rhinoceros, which is just absolutely incredible. Uh, or the lemurs, they're such characters. I'm really passionate about the environment. Um, I get paid to work in paradise, pretty much. I mean.